All right. Um, Mike D. Finns UK, should the Dolphins draft a quarterback at three or trade down? Shereen, chances are that there will be two quarterbacks gone in the first two picks, Trevor Lawrence and Zach Wilson. What do you think the Dolphins should do? Have they seen enough from Tua to say, let's take a shot with another franchise quarterback like the Cardinals did a couple of years ago? Or should they give Tua another shot and get some other area of need addressed? I haven't seen enough of Tua, but they've certainly seen him in practice and, and apparently think that he's the real deal. At least they've said that publicly, Mike, and I get no indication that they're going to use the third pick on a quarterback. If I had any question at all it, that Tua is the real deal, I'm drafting a quarterback with the third pick. If I don't have a question, if I think Tua is my quarterback, I'm going to trade down and get those additional picks because, boy, Mike, they can really get a haul out of this draft that will set them up to contend for the next few years if indeed Tua is the real deal. Yeah, and, and it all comes down to how you feel about whoever is going to be left after Lawrence and Wilson. Do you really feel strongly about that guy, who whoever it is? And Deshaun Watson is a, is a factor in all of this, too. I mean, there have been ugly incidents that eventually have gone away. And uh, that, that doesn't make any of it right. I'm just saying this is not something that, I, I, mean, I mean, Michael Vick went to federal prison for two years and he was back in the NFL. I, I, I think that at some point, the Dolphins need to make a football decision about whether or not this is a move they want to try to make, understanding that there will be PR fallout but um, and, and, and understanding and coming to a conclusion as to whether or not they think that he did what he did. Again, if he did what he did, and this is where I, I struggle in this landmine, if he did what he did, he gets everything he deserves. But even then, that doesn't mean he goes to prison for the rest of his life. I, 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 don't, I mean, maybe some of these allegations would set him up for a long prison sentence if he gets prosecuted. But for civil lawsuits, whatever the verdict is, you just move on. And uh, yeah, he'd be punished by the league. But it's not like he'll never play again. He's still fairly young. So that's part of what these teams have to factor into their analysis. Yeah, I could see Deshaun Watson playing for the Dolphins one day, Mike. And that's a great point because, yeah. you know, they, they have a quarterback they could trade. And they obviously have draft capital this year. And it doesn't look like it's going to happen before the draft this year. But at some point, I could see the Dolphins being in play for Deshaun Watson. Hi, I'm Mike Tirico, and thanks for watching. Make sure to hit subscribe for the latest news and highlights from NBC Sports.